All right, so let's start with the big story that we are tracking on Vyond at this hour. And this is a shocking incident that's been reported in Pakistan, where four women were reportedly assaulted in broad daylight in the Punjab province in Pakistan. The incident took place on Monday morning in a very crowded bazaar in the city of Faisalabad. Now, according to reports that have come in, the four women were reportedly trash pickers who were first mercilessly beaten and then paraded naked. One of the victims works as a sanitation employee who later informed the police about this incident. She reported that the four women were thirsty and had gone into an electronics shop to ask for some water. The owner of the shop then accused them of entering the shop with an intention of shoplifting and that is when the neighbouring shopkeepers also grabbed the women and began to assault them mercilessly. Now, the Punjab police then swung into action after the video went viral on social media in Pakistan. The Punjab police has now arrested at least five of the ten suspects who are involved in the case. Now, appalled by the incident, Twitter users in Pakistan have slammed the manner in which the police has, of course, responded later. One of the Twitter users said that women are stripped naked for allegedly being involved in shoplifting in the middle of the road. There is something seriously that has gone wrong in this country. Moreover, the Punjab police is also facing a lot of flack for sharing the raw video of the assault on their official Twitter page. The police failed to respect the survivors and their dignity. So this is a shocking incident that has been reported in Pakistan in the city of Faisalabad where four women who reportedly had gone into a electronics shop. They were trash pickers. The shopkeeper then accused them of entering into his shop with the intention of shoplifting. That is when other shopkeepers also got involved. They thrashed the women and then paraded them naked. The police has now arrested five to six of these shopkeepers who were involved in this brutal assault of these four women. And this, remember, is an incident that has happened in the Punjab province in the city of Faisalabad in Pakistan. The police has arrested about five to six of them and more investigations are underway. But this is an incident that has caused a lot of outrage within Pakistan where questions have been raised as to is, is humanity dead that an incident of this nature has taken place. Four women enter into a shop irrespective of, of what, what may have unfolded. The question, of course, is if the shopkeepers believed that, that they had entered into the shop with the intention to perhaps shoplift, the police could have been called. But what was the point of thrashing the women in broad daylight and then parading them naked? So the incident took place on Monday morning in a very crowded bazaar in Faisalabad. The four women reportedly were trash pickers and they were first mercilessly beaten and then paraded naked. One of the victims also works as a sanitation employee who later informed the police about this episode. She reported that the four women were thirsty and had gone into an electronics shop to ask for some water. The owner of the shop accused them of entering with an intention to steal. And that is when the neighbouring shopkeepers grabbed the women and began to assault them. So the Punjab police eventually swung into action. The video of this assault, the CCTV footage spread like wildfire on social media in Pakistan. So far, the Punjab police is said to have arrested about five of the ten suspects who were involved in this assault. Now, appalled by the incident, Twitter users in Pakistan conveyed their absolute disgust. One of the Twitter users said, and I quote, women are stripped naked for allegedly being involved in robbery in the middle of the road. There is something that is seriously wrong with this country. Another person on Twitter posted, and I quote him here, Another day, another incident of mass violence. Two women beaten, stripped and paraded in public in Faisalabad. This is happening with mind-numbing regularity. Now, the horrifying incident which took place just a few days after the brutal mob lynching in Sialkot 
and also amidst a wave of violence, which which Pakistan has of course been undergoing as part of the protests, etc. This this of course has shocked the nation. A lot of people are asking questions about what has gone wrong in terms of how an incident of this nature could have even happened and to give us more more insights and updates in terms of what's in fact been happening as a part of this incident and the investigation subsequently we joined in by my colleague Anas Malik who's joining us live from Islamabad Anas bring us up to speed with what's the latest on the story well, another heinous act, violence against women continues in Pakistan. Uh, and this time, four women uh, who were allegedly or alleged of uh, uh, stealing things, uh, they were subjected to brutal violence and torture. Uh, and that happened in Faisalabad, in Pakistan's uh, Faisalabad, uh, which is known as the textile city of the country as well. Uh, and that uh, four women were alleged of theft, uh, and then uh, they were beaten, and then they were paraded naked. Now, uh, all those uh, five suspects who were involved in this act, uh, it, uh, uh, those who are said to be shopkeepers of the area, have been arrested by the police. The police have vowed that they will be bringing the preparators to just to justice, and that justice will be done uh, uh, with with the women as well. Given that uh, nobody is allowed to take the law into their own hands, number one and number two, uh, for the fact that uh, uh, such an act. Uh, of parading anybody in naked uh, in public in naked uh, uh, in public uh, uh, can tan mount to the uh, the the uh, uh, the uh, uh, punishment can tan mount to up to uh, death sentence as well so the police are saying that they will not uh, they will not be sparing uh, 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 those who are involved but the bigger problem remains is that uh, the the bigger challenge at, ha at hand is with regards to this uh, mob justice or uh, mob violence mentality that they be the jury judge and executioner and that is what the challenge is, uh, is at hand for the government to deal with Saleh. all right we'll have to leave there thank you very much indeed anas malik for joining us and getting us all those updates then beyond is now available in your country download the app now and get all the news on the move